we have auto sequence start. That first umbilical tower separating from the booster. There's one more to go that will uh, separate shortly. Under 30 seconds. Auto sequence initiated. We have auto sequence start. Oxygen. The engine's igniting, the launch command issued. Again, the engines will fire, ramping up towards flight speed. And liftoff. Peggy Whitson, Oleg Novitsky, and Tomas Pesquet rocketing towards the International Space Station. The rocket lighting up the night sky there in Baikonur. All initial performance calls indicate everything nominal or normal. First stage delivering 930,000 pounds of thrust through those four boosters in the single core engine. First stage measuring 68 feet in length and 24 feet in diameter. It's going to burn liquid fuel for the first two minutes and six seconds of the flight. Everything continuing to look steady, straight as an arrow for the Soyuz as it continues to rocket off again. Launched right on time at 2.20 p.m. Central, 3.20 p.m. Eastern. Everything's fine on board. Spherical tank pressure is nominal. We copy. Over 70 seconds, one minute, 10 seconds into the flight velocity of the Soyuz now over 1,100 miles per hour. 80 seconds into flight. Control and motion control systems are working nominally. Everything's fine on board. We copy. The rest of the second stage are working nominally. Performance calls with the booster continuing to look great. So he's continuing to fly straight and true. And there you see the four strap-ons breaking away in the night sky. There, uh, the first four stage, uh, the first stage boosters being jettisoned. Copy. Their job complete. They drop away at an altitude of about 28 statute miles. The Soyuz traveling at over 3,300 miles per hour. Now powered by the second stage. Structure and the engines are nominal. The crew is feeling fine. We copy. We see you guys and we confirm. Steering, jettisoning, confirmed, copy. And so at this point, the launch shroud has been jettisoned. The Soyuz now exposed to the air and soon to space. The rocket at an altitude about 48 miles high. On the second video camera and the descent. Getting a wave there from NASA astronaut Peggy Whitson making her third journey to the International Space Station. Here are you, 5x5. Seated just next to Russian cosmonaut Oleg Novitsky. At this point, the Soyuz traveling at a speed of about 4,700 miles an hour. The crew is feeling fine. So the second stage continuing to burn, uh, that core stage that also flies during the uh, the.